Hello, and welcome to a Wednesday edition of Robert vs. The New York Times Crossword. Today it's uh, Wednesday, June 29th, so let's jump into the Wednesday mini. Here's your spoiler alert. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. The mini's always free to play. Alright, let's do it. Shade here. Anime Delve S. Uh, DMV C. Jeans. What? Call for change. Heads or tails. Wow. Heads or tails. Crossing at this A here. For shade. Yep. Very nice. Now for the main event, that's the Wednesday Daily Grade, which is by Jared Goodsmith today. Maybe it's Goudsmith, I'm not sure. But here's their spoiler alert. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. The Daily Grid does require a New York Times game subscription. All right, let's see what uh, Jared Goudsmith has in store for us. Let's get into it. It's Chai there, not sure about that. Sicente minutas is aura, certain horses. And still being debugged in beta. Make a scapegoat of his blame. VIP commands his limos, hen hatchlings. It's brood, right? This is Shri. Uh, generic Himalayan humanoid. The abominable snowman, right? Yeah. So we have a Rebus? Or is it just. This is like Sabro or something? Capacious Rumi. This is, uh, I forget, Nile. <laughs> place to pitch a product. Add something. Alright. So, partner of raised. Born and raised. This is CBGB. Based on actual events. Dutch cheese is Edom. Oh, I see. This is going to be an ab rebus. Maybe. So this is actually a bomb and apple. Picks up again. This is... Refab, unclear mental state. Rehab, prickly pear. This is aloe. Sorry, prickly plant. This is this. State bird of Hawaii is the Nini. Far with force and neighbor of Montana is Idaho. Kigali resident is a Rwandan. Finish gift wrapping, say, and not give up, say. Part of it may concern is whom? Have you been? What's new? This is ODs here. Throw with force. This is damn up and a vast. Entice is tempt. Pop and fresh is a mascot. Norse god thunder is Thor. Geogra geographical inits is USSR. Relative of a core anglais, that's the oboe. Dislike with passion is abhor. By the way, if you want to type in a rebus, you just hit escape or you hit the rebus button in that upper right. Uh, if you're on your phone, you just hit rebus on the second keyboard. Consumes in a way. Shares words, ours. Bit of binary code is a zero here. Core exercises, or a hint to eight scores in the puzzle. Ab crunches, right? Uh uh. This is Isuzu, Aaron, Catherine of Beetlejuice, not sure. This is Orcas, Cool Head. The magic word abracadabra. Here's the Friar's home as an Abbey. Uh, Cisco or something, right? Aromatic ever evergreens, cedars, consumes, reeds, this is USO, cool head. Not sure. Carried bits is Ren, Rube Goldberg, affected, uh, impacted, okay. I'm spelling cadaver like the Pokemon. This is ale, add space, Nyala, prickly pen, this is aloe, not falling horse onto, this is nota bene. Hard C, his uh, cool starts with a hard C. Gave sustenance is fed, not give up. How many abs do we have so far? We have. Oh, this is grabbed a bite. So they're all double ab phrases. So this one. Where should the other one be? Um, two, four, six. This one, fit to live in. Inhabitable. Yeah, they're all double ab phrases. A little more than. This is mirror here. This is whom? Oval hijab. Not right the second in a bit. 
show and lie. Tie a bow. Not give up. This is a blink. Uh, 30 days half September fight. A glint. Um, this is haze, I guess. Alright. We've got a Wednesday Rebus. But quite a friendly Rebus. Relatively friendly. Not the fastest ones they still, but Ab crunches the Zerelia here, and the other four themers all have double abs in them. Grabbed a bite, inhabitable, abominable snowman, abracadabra. Yeah, nice revealer. Ab crunches. Even you might just call them crunches, but uh Yeah, I guess you'd usually just call them crunches, right? I don't know if you call them ab crunches, but it's clear what was meant by it. Yeah, let's look at the crosses though. Arabs, in a bit, tie a bow. Not great. Feels like an arbitrary noun, uh, sorry, arbitrary verb, a uh, noun. Tie a knot. Take a bow. Those are, I think those actually are both more legitimate than tie a bow, but. Hijab is nice. Sabra Rehab. Abby and Abhor. So, pretty clean around the themers. Um, not used to... Wednesday Rebuses are fairly rare, but like I said, if you want to type one in, you hit Escape, or you click this little Rebus button here. If you're on the, uh, the phone, you hit More on the keyboard, and Rebus is one of the options. Yeah. I think when you first start puzzles, when you first start crosswording, rebuses sort of feel like they're cheating. It's like breaking the rules. Um, but as you get more, as your sense for expecting trickery goes up, it becomes really quite a, a fun surprise to find them. Didn't know Donna Tart. Adam, shout out to Liz. Yeah. Kigali is one of the African capitals I memorized. Um, well, I tried to memorize all of them, but yeah. Next week I'm going to be on Jeopardy. I guess this is my announcement. I'll, I'll announce it at the beginning of the video next week, once I'm actually up on the web Jeopardy website. But yeah, if you made it to this point in the video, now you know. Um, why is it? Yeah, okay. Did the timer change? The timer on the New York Times website is is really picky. It changed again. Yeah, so I guess I need to watch the video to know how. Okay, it actually took 4:02, but yeah, very glitchy. I think it, the timing actually works better on the app. Anyway, I'm just saying random things at this point. It's all it's all a haze. Yeah, bottomless snowman is a nice 15 <laughs> 15 square. It's actually 17 letters, right? But it's clued so easily. I think that's um, one reason this this Rebus puzzle is Wednesday enough. Because it's all clued so nicely. Catherine O'Hara. Is that is that the same O'Hara who's on Schitt's Creek? That I've looked up before. I've even watched a few episodes of Schitt's Creek. Um, what has she been in? Second City, Television, Rosie, Eel Juice, The Nightmare Before Christmas. Yeah, and now, or 2015 to 2020 on Schitt's Creek. But be included here as Beetlejuice, so maybe uh maybe Jared is a Beetlejuice fan, perhaps. Yeah the Koranglay is the English horn, which looks pretty much like an oboe. Cisco. Yeah CBGB stands for something that I don't remember. <laughs> but it's a famous club in New York supposedly. Country, bluegrass, and blues. 
CBGB. Never been there. You don't even know where it is. Ah, it's pretty far south. It's in the East Village. I've lost the dot, but somewhere around here. In beta and in a bit. The in doesn't. The in dupe doesn't bother me too much. Yeah, you rehab a house. I know refab, I guess, means refabricate. But don't you really renovate a house? I don't really. To me, rehab says more like. Well, I'm like rehabbing my foot right now. We might go to rehab for a substance addiction. Nice little Z there. And Nyala. Let's look up what Nyala look like. They look like. <laughs> I always say this, they look like fancy deer. But actually, they look more like a. Uh, right, it looks like a deer wearing a wildebeest costume for Halloween. That's what it looks like to me. Let me know if you see it. Uh, <laughs> um, Nota bene. What is Poppin' Fresh a mascot for? I only recognize Tony the Tiger. Ah, the Pillsbury Doughboy is called a Poppin' Fresh? Who knew? Wow, it's got sort of like a, a hip-hop name or something. Poppin' Fresh. Interesting clue on hard C. I wonder how this has been um, clued before. Right, these ones that are just about like how the word is uh, spelled or pronounced. Can opener. Cod piece. Canadian capital. Cold front. Cold start. Cabbage head. So I wonder if um. What was our clue again? Cool head. I wonder if that's new. I don't know exactly how good the database on Crossword Tracker is, but it appears to be somewhat new. <laughs> yep. Rube Goldberg, yeah. The Rube Goldberg machine is like a really elaborate machine for doing very little, or a very simple task. Yeah, nice little Wednesday Rebus there. So, um, I wonder what the Thursday puzzle will feature. Probably not a Rebus. I think they don't like to do too many Rebuses, so we'll have some sort of other trickery tomorrow. Slightly slow for Wednesday, but it was a Rebus. So pretty fast for Rebus. Leaderboard for tomorrow, we've got KFS Venta, Hanami Hills. Uh, what about the secret leaderboard? Haven't checked in a while. Sorry to you, secret leaderboard folks. We have Kimball in 30 seconds. Shout out to you, Kimball. Anyway, thanks for watching. Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And I'll see you tomorrow for some Thursday puzzles. See you then.